What's up guys, it's Stratus. It is currently 2 a.m. in the morning. I really don't know why I'm making a video, but I woke up and decided I wanted to make one. So here we are, we're at I4MX, which is a real life replica track of a track down in Florida. Um, it looks like there's actually two tracks, so I thought I'd hop on and check it out. I want to say I saw a YouTube video, now that I see this house, I want to say I saw a YouTube video of it already, and it's supposed to be like a replica of someone's personal track, maybe a pro rider, not really sure, probably something that I should know, but I don't know, so I apologize. We're just going to scoot around on it for a little bit. Alright, so here's the starting gates. Some little whoops, not very big. Some really big pull turns. I thought that was a roller. It most definitely was not a roller. Let's try that again. I guess I forgot the golden rule. When in doubt, hit it flat out. Alright, maybe not flat out. Because I just over jumped the absolute crap out of that. Interesting texture for water. Back end is going to slide out. Ooh, whoopsies. Nice little double over some trees. Now, they're not really booters, they're kind of more of just a uh, real flat speed jumps, I guess you could say. Alright, so that was a lap on this track. Not really sure what I think about it. Seemed pretty okay. Um, let's see, that was the big track I just rode. Let's see if I can find the smaller track in the middle. So there's the starting gate, so I just need to go straight. Okay. Alright, so here's the starting gate. There's the house. So I should just have to go straight, if we don't fall through the map here, go for a nice little swim. Thought it was over here, is this it? This is a track that we were already on. Am I going crazy? I thought that track map said that it was behind the turn. Take a right and then go straight. But there's a big pond right there. Oh, so maybe he doesn't have that track. Maybe that makes sense. It's just a big pond. Okay. So I guess I thought there was two tracks, but it's actually just this track. So my bad. I guess we'll do some more laps around it then. Really fast track for sure. Remember 
driver to slow down that time. Oops. Looked away for a second. I'm curious, I want to go to YouTube and watch some videos of this track, and I'm curious to see if it's actually this fast, or if it's this is kind of a little too much of a scale. You actually, oop, whoopsies. I'm curious if they actually have you jumping over trees in real life, or if they just did that for kind of an artistic effect. Wow, even though this track is super easy, I've, I've managed to crash twice this lap. Alright, I'm gonna do one more lap. It's honestly a pretty basic track. Now, I don't mean to knock on the uh, creator or anything, because I know tracks are really difficult to make. But I think it's just a really easy track. Which it may be like that in real life, I'm not really sure. Uh, I haven't been on a dirt bike in since I was a kid, so yeah, I, this is definitely not one of the tracks that I raced on, so I have no idea how realistic this is. I feel like these doubles probably should kick you up higher, maybe. I definitely don't feel like a public track would have you jumping over trees. Wow, landed flat. I guess that's pretty much it for this track. Um, my fault for thinking there were two tracks. Actually, it looks like there might be a jump over here. I'm gonna go check it out. Oh yeah, that's definitely a jump. I was about to end the video, but uh, I'm gonna hit this really quick. Looks like we're gonna jump over the house. Jump through the house. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I hit that from the wrong side. I don't know, this one, no, nah, I definitely hit it from the right side. I was definitely not going fast enough. Let's give it one more shot. If I can find my way back. Yeah, I'm not even coming close. <laughs> I don't know if you need to be on a 450 or what, but yeah, that's pretty much for this racetrack. It's i4MX. Link is in the description. Thanks for watching the video, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.